Hi everybody, welcome back to Chaos Gate Demon Hunters. Dan here with No Games for Old Men, and we have just slid in here to Legata Prime sideways with just maybe a day left on the timer here to complete this mission. This is what should be a cakewalk. It is a bloom corruption level two. We've got a couple of red blue seeds. That's not blue at all. I said red and then I went to blue. It's clearly yellow. Uh wow. This is, this is how it's going to go today, apparently. Uh, one red seed, perhaps, and some enemies that we can't identify, but look at... There's going to be a few of them, so we got to be prepared for that. But it's only a Bloom Corruption level 2, so I think that maybe won't be too bad. Three enemy reinforcements available, though. If we eliminate all seed carriers, we'll get two requisition. There's also a Glorious Deed available. Kill nine enemies with melee weapons for an additional three requisition. I think we can do that. Ten Servitors, and we've got some Tier 3 requisition uh, armory items available for us. So let's get started on this. Uh, yes, I know I don't have anything going in the Manufactorum because I don't have enough Servitors at the moment, which is why we are here to get these Servitors. So let's go. Yes, we are going to do the glory deed. So, for this mission, this I've already pre-selected these guys and gotten them loaded out. So we've got Iolanthus the Justicar. We've got Decrin as the Apothecary. We've got Zabus as the Interceptor. Storm suffered a wound in the previous mission, so he has about three days. He's just chilling in the infirmary. Uh, playing Xbox or something. And Zabus, however, does have Teleport Strike, and he also has Support Fire. So both of those are abilities that Storm also has. So Zabus and Storm, uh, I'm guessing they uh, they trained together because they their, their abilities are almost identical. Back for his second mission is, uh, I'm guessing, well, obviously, Decrin the Apothecary and Decrin the Chaplain are uh, from the Jane, same gene seed strain. So this one, Agraval Decrin, is now a rank 3 Chaplain. And, again, we're just going to see if we can figure out how to use these guys the best. I have him with a... Oh, do I want... Do I need him with a Medicaid skull? I've got... I've got the, um, I've got the Apothecary. Maybe what we do... Oh, I'm glad I, I'm glad I did this. Maybe what we do with him, then, is swap out that Medicaid skull for, uh, something that's going to either... We could do, yeah, let's do the Domina Liber Demonica. Give ourselves two extra crit damage and a bonus 15% crit chance for melee attacks. Since we're going to be spending all of our energy trying to get melee kills, especially early on. Okay, stratagems. Uh, I've got my trusty Quicksilver and heal available. Do I want to swap heal out for something else? I don't have a Prognosticar attuned to this planet, so I won't have access to the bonus stratagem that that provides. Currently, I have that set to Precision Bombardment. Do I want to swap heal for that so I've got access to it? Or do I just... What if I go with Immobilize? Let's try that. I've never used Torpor before. Quicksilver is just too darned useful. And I'm, I'm wary of giving that one up because it's just two free action points for somebody. Okay, let's go! Always gotta take a screenshot of the crew as they're on their way out the teleportarium. It's like a class photo, you know? It could also be the last time we ever see one of them. That's not true. Nobody is at... Nobody is down to one resilience point yet, so I am not in danger of... Losing someone to combat. However, if somebody does, does a, uh, take a critical wound, it's possible there is a chance that they will not make it through the when they're trying to heal in the infirmary or the apothecarian. 
That happened once before, and I think that was on my other playthrough when I was trying to play it on the harder difficulty and failed miserably. Status. Ultramarines currently engaged with a force of word bearers. Look at that moon. Have they detected us? Negative. Do you take me for some half augmented engines here? <laughs> the Inquisitor meant to Calm down, do Dominant. Yeah, come on. We will locate and destroy the seeds and leave the rest on the right. All right, so, oh wow, There's some drop pods here. All right, so we've got a two Dolorous carriers and a Morbus carrier. Three Dolorous carriers? Okay, great. Four seed carriers. We've never seen that before. There's, we've had two, I think three. I think we've had three was the most we've had before. All right. Zabus. Zabus. Let's... I think what we'll do... All right, so he's up there. He's here. I think what we will do... Oh, first we've got to check and make sure there aren't any seed pods around. Not not within our immediate vicinity. So let's... Let's get you up here behind this cargo container. See if we can oh see around way. the corner there. Anything yet? Nothing, but they're close. If we can bait them to come this way, we could possibly shoot that and get some damage. Oh, come on. Chaplain. Okay, here now we can play with the litanies. Okay, so litanies are activated abilities. So we've got the litany of hate. Each knight who executes an enemy gains an additional AP. So they'll the executor. The executioner will receive two AP for an execution rather than just one. And then I've got provoke, which I didn't really make great use of last time, his, his very first mission out, so we'll see if we can improve our ability there. Alright, so let's get you up here next to this trench wall. You can go over that pipe, I kind of figured you'd go around it easy way, but sure. Standing ready. Apothecary Decrin, uh, let's get you up here next to your brother. Onward, brothers! Your literal brother, not just your battle Ooh. brother. And squad leader Iolanthus, let's put you up here, up in the front. Onward, brothers! They're all just vaulting over that pipe there. None of them want to go easy. Okay, so let's, uh, there's nobody triggered yet, so let's let's go ahead and move Scooch our guys a little bit closer. Moving now. Scooch. We strive. Oh nice. Got a free Aegis shield. And it's gone. That's how quickly that happens. Okay, so we've got a pipe cover here that we can use as a frisbee. I think maybe we want to bring our crew this way because there's cover options here. That'll bait them to come this way. We might be able to get, get some damage with the blast here. We'll also be in a position to grab this and chuck it. So that's the plan. So yeah, let's use Taking the position. apothecary first. Yes, Commander. The, the brothers Decrin will get up here. Actually, let's get him to here. Yes, there we go. Unwanted. Okay, so we've got a plague bearer. Prepare to engage. Okay, here's our seed carrier. Is a cultist. We've got two cultists, three cultists. Really? These guys are being led by oh, plague ridden, excuse me. Does he He doesn't have oh he does psychic spread attack. 
so I think that means I can... Oh, what's Foul Conduit? When the Plague Ridden is attacked, it has a 100% chance to cause a warp... Okay, right. Oh, right. Psychic Support Blast Demonic Icon. Okay. Now... Is that shootable? Oh, that was Iolanthus. I didn't move the right guy. That doesn't seem like a good use of this. I'm only going to hit the Plague Ridden and it's just going to do a sliver of damage. So I think we'll wait. Maybe, maybe these guys will come a little closer. Zabus. Unleash me. This could be a good opportunity. Oh, you know what? You know what we need to do first? What is your will? Very first is extract this seed from him. But we can't because I don't have sight on him. Alright, well, you've got three actions. Let's get you from here. You over to here, then maybe. Nope, still don't have a view. <laughs> My blade is yours. Okay, Zavis. Then, how about we attempt this? Ooh, nope, that's uh, not gonna be great. Alright, let's move you first then. On my way. Okay. Now, if we teleport strike, we can get him, him, and him, and him. Oh, no, we can't. Okay, let's see. Let's see. If we go boop. Boop, boop, boop. Hmm. It's like a puzzle I'm trying to find the the most effective path. Hmm. Well, what I could do is is end him here. And then get an extra strike in on this guy. Ah! Oh, sweet. And he just gave himself an extra... What is that called? Teleport boost? Where he gives himself an extra action point? I think. Okay. Now, we get the kill here, we get the kill here. So let's go here. Get rid of this. And there is our first of nine. I am the Empress Vengeance. Then what we could do is we'll give Honor the Chapter to him. Do we warp charge it? It'll give him a willpower and three. Yeah. Strike four. Okay, and with that, standing ready. You're gonna come here. Yeah. As ordered. Great. Get up. And Get then. Up. Oh, that's gonna take you. I got it. I got it. Do this then, or do we work on this thing? I think I've got to. I think I've got to work on this guy here. Force strike is going to give me a big bonus to crit damage or crit chance. So, oh, nice. Okay. 
Uh, let's afflict Stream of Corruption. Afflict? Is that what I said? I meant disable. I think I was reading the text and it said Stream of Corruption afflicts something. I, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, now he's down to, s or he will be down to seven. Here's what here's what I'm thinking. Maybe I can do next is if I can get somebody in a position to shoot My blade is yours. to shoot at that guy, then Zabus will use his Moving out. supporting fire ability to do extra damage. Cybolt. I am just really... Uh, yeah, that'll do an extra point of damage. I'm just really uh, boosting the warp surge right now. Awesome. And the supporting fire doesn't use doesn't use an ability, or it doesn't use an ability point. Action point, that's what I'm trying to say. Good God. All right, here we go. Dead. Who's next, brothers? Sweet. Okay, now, get him. He could get all the way around here. And 20% crit chance. No, okay, we're not gonna force strike this time. Boom! Woohoo! Die! 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 Hey now. Ball monster! They're closing in around me. And we've already triggered a warp surge because we used all those abilities. Enemies can't be stunned for three turns. Wow. Okay, so now he is definitely within There's line of sight. Up. So we're gonna We're gonna snag this seed. I'm glad that Overwatch isn't triggered by those things. Like, they, they can't shoot the skull out of the sky. I pull the seed of this rot. Although I suppose that would... That would add some new level of strategy. to have to decide when to use your skulls. So that that doesn't happen. Okay, let's... Let's go ahead and finish this guy off. Finish me! So this is... Four. She have five left. Yep. All right. Five more enemies to kill. Melee attacks. Let's see. Let's just keep heading this direction. Ah, this guy here. All right. Um. Yeah. Just gonna charge across this empty space to get over there as quickly as possible. Jeez, he can get far. Seeking the Tainted. Nice long jump. Okay, now we need to be a little more cautious. They are moving this direction. So... 
On my way. Okay. At your service. Really? All right. Let's, what is your will? Let's get Zabus up here first. Thing. Oh, he's in Terminator armor. Chaplain's in Terminator armor. That's why he can't climb this wall. Yes, sir. Okay. I'm trying to clump my guys up before I trigger. I am with you. Trigger the enemy. I am, sir. Okay. That way they all get their. Their extra. Or their action turns re replenish all at once. While they're all together. And I'm not wasting actions trying to get people caught up. Okay, let's get him up to. There. Unleash me! Form a little conga line here. This doesn't do it. Onward, brothers! Yep. Ooh! Four? Five? Plague Marines? Okay. That's nice that they just decided to park it right there next to that pile of plasma batteries. Okay, he's gonna overwatch. With his gross little tentacle hand. Don't, Brothers, don't, I have discovered the enemy. I don't know what they're doing there. Okay, first things Iolanthus. first. Iolanthus, can you snag the seed? How many does he have? Three. Nice. Okay, get the little skull over there. Okay. No vision. That makes sense. All right. I am here to serve. Chaplain Decrin, let's get you over here behind yes, this low cover. And let's have you shoot this plasma battery. Oh! Wow, that destroyed the container, but didn't do any damage to the guy inside. That's interesting. Okay, so when I used Provoke in the very first mission that I had him in, which was like two missions ago, a cultist ran at him. Like, even though he had a, a firearm, he ran at the chaplain. So my thought was to set up overwatches. And I wonder if I wonder if that actually would work. Because I don't think I want to. Um, maybe I don't know. Do I want to? I am here to serve. Use Zabus right orders. here. Because if he, if he does a teleport strike, I'm concerned that he's going to be damaged by whatever ground this is. He's teleporting through it. He's not going to land in it, but. I don't know how that works. So if we start with this guy... Oh, that'll be it then. Okay, if we start with this guy, that'll be that. What if we do... Oh, too bad I can't target him. Oh, nobody has sight on him, that's what it is. So go boop, boop, and boop. And I can stop him here. Okay. And now let's let's get a let's get a slap in here. 
taste my fury. Let's get a critical. Come on, man. I need a critical. All right, maybe now he can see this guy. Maybe, maybe I can use the skull on him now. No, it ha has to be Islandus. Okay, so nobody else can guide the skull. That's a bummer. Okay, how about now? There we go. Let's see. If he I think he'll be he's just outside the range, but he can he can shoot this guy. Do I want to get this guy? And if I side bolt. Mm, It'll do two extra damage, which means I can still... Somebody else can shoot him. God damn it. That would... <laughs> if I had I side bolted, that would have killed him. <laughs> oh, gosh. Why do I suck at this game so bad? Uh, oh, he's got no sight. Okay, let's see how we can do this better. This guy still has full armor and ammo. Wow. So what if I provoke him? Maybe it would be better to provoke these guys, though. I don't know. Standing ready. Okay, well, still, let's let's finish this off here. Hmm. Yeah, he's got just the one action left. What does warp charging do? Oh, it crazes! Oh, that's right. Let's do that with this, these guys then. Let's do that. We'll warp charge it to cause crazed because then they, they might attack each other. They might not still, but they might. And in the meantime, let's see, this is high cover, so I don't think you can see over it. That is in the line of fire. As you will. So if we step him here, and we shoot at him, that will ca trigger supporting fire. No, what are you doing? You're supposed to shoot. Oh my god. Oh lord. Again! Again! Did that seriously happen? Excellent. Great, so that worked on one guy. One guy was crazed. What a goof, man. I was I meant to shoot that guy and then trigger supporting fire from him. Okay, well at least we got this guy when he tried to tried to move. Alright, so we've got 
he's plagued, so we need to... How many uses of this do I have? One. Uh... All right, Chaplain, how injured are you? You're injured two, you've got plague though. I don't want you to have plague. Be able to see him. Okay, so what, what if I. What is this? Is this like gross land? Hmm. Yes, Commander. Okay, what if we crush and charge? Did I just hit my apothecary with that? Oh! Wow! And he's got another action available. So... Do I shoot this guy and then get a supporting fire shot? You can make Nail! You are being judged. Ninny. Okay, now let's get him. Uh, do we want to heal our own plague? Yeah. He's also hurt pretty bad too. Pure among impurity. Now, Aye, sir. You run around the container. Chaplain, now you're gonna go toe to toe with this guy. Hey. And just beat <laughs> on the brat. There we go. Let's see. How many stuns does he have? Oh, we can't be stunned because it's that warp surge. So, sample raged weapon. He can still hit us with that sword of his. Okay, and then with him, we'll teleport in behind this guy. Right there. Davis, I know you can see that spot. Come on. Right there. Okay, fine. Right here. What is the deal? Oh, that's the teleport strike I was on. I want just regular teleport. <laughs> uh, yay! I love it when he regenerates an action point. We don't need it in this case, but... Awesome. Another battle ends in triumph. Okay, that is two combats. We got eight kills with melee weapons in that. We only need one more, and there are two more seed carriers. Uh, we have reached the end of the battlefield here. Still no seed pods anywhere around. That's... Oop, is this one? Look at that. Squeaky wheel gets the grease. All right, we've got ourselves a seed pod. As we make our way toward this guy here. So let's hop on over. Uh, there's a door here. We'll go through the door. Do I want to go through the door or just to the door for right now? Let's just go to it. I don't want to go through it just yet. Oh, he is still plagued. So we'll see if the apothecary can do anything. I think this apothecary has only got one use of his. Praise the Emperor. Yeah, damn. Okay, so what we're gonna do is just keep an eye on the chaplain. His plague will run its course. 
he'll, he'll take six total points of damage from that, and then we'll use Battlefield Medicine on him. So we'll want to make sure the Apothecary has... What's the English word for it? Willpower points. Alright. Now, this is gross territory. We don't want you to go through that, so you're going to have to go all the way around. With me, my brother. Which doesn't put you too far behind. Is there another path I can take to get there? Uh, I could. I could. It could be the little surprise coming around the corner. Alright, let's see what happens here. Sabus, do I want you kicking this door down just yet? I think there's enough distance. Well, we'll see. Famous last words. Okay, good. So, oh, wait a minute. Is that plague? Did that just say three? Like, there's only three more. Max one willpower for the remainder of the mission. Grandfather, Nurgle, you are a piece. Yeah, okay, so he's going to take two more turns at least. So, was that a five turn plague then that he took? Jeez. Okay. First order of business is to do this. Moving now. What do we get? What do we get? Wow, more red seed. This is a red seed heavy planet. Decra. Mm. We strive. Come on. Loremaster Curtis was giving me crap for taking cover. Um, to that I say only a fool stands out in the open to get shot. I'm setting them up for the encounter that is to come. What is your will? On my way. So we've got two pla a plague ridden and a plague bearer. Oh, he mutated already. He gave himself two armor. You, what do we have here? You little. Unleash me. Okay. Let's get. I yes, want this sir. coming around the mountain here. And I guess I don't think. Yeah, there's not. Oops, whoops. Undo. I don't have the range yet. My way. So these are both melee guys. So we're gonna just set up some overwatches. Master Curtis is going to make fun of me for it, but it's just for this, just for this turn, Curtis. It's going to be fine. As my chaplain continues to suffer from COVID. Well. Wow. Jeez. Whoa! Six extra hit points. Holy Feel crap. my wrath. <laughs> what? Did they? Are they all plagued now? Oh, they're blinded. 
Minus two damage with ranged attacks. Okay, well, then we'll... We'll crush you with my fists instead. Little, little seed grabber, can you not... Can't get there yet, huh? Iolanthus isn't affected by that. He's not blinded. Yoink! I forgot to look to see how many he has. I've claimed the seed. Probably two or three, I would guess. And you are... Oh, you are just out of range. But let's see if... You're at long range. Let's see if they support fire. No, support fire did not trigger. Okay. Then... do in this case. Let's take your orders. The apothecary and put him on top of this crate and have him stab down into the skull of this thing with Narthesium. Oh sweet. Let's disable the melee weapon. I think we'll kill him this turn, but it's just fun to hack their arms off. Is he stunned? Oh, and Grant and that uh, that curse is done too. So now he's stunned. Sweet. Now everybody gets a free action point. I am the wrath of Zyphos. Oh, I should have done the litany of hate. Crap! I should have done that first. See, you get a new character class, and you for, you don't know, you don't know how to use it yet. What is your will? Okay, one action. Eh, you can't really get there. We can shoot at him. Do a little bit of damage. Is he out of ammo? Oh, that's why it's not triggering. I have sanctified my realms. Ugh. Oh well. Okay, you run over here and you punch. You punch a lot with your sword. Punch with your sword. Feel my raw. Yeah. One more time. Yeah. Taste my fury. Sweet. I just heard a bunch of like screaming outside. Ah, oh, the neighborhood kids, they are awake. Uh what am I doing with him? Yes, we're we're going to punch. More punching. All the punching. And he's stunned. Okay, but this is the this is gonna be the killing blow, and it's the end of the combat, so there's no reason to cast Litany of Hate. Sadly. Enemies destroyed. But it is something to keep in mind. Something to remember. Okay. We have completed our glorious deed. And now we must make our way all the way over here to get this guy. So that is what we are going to do next. And hopefully it will take enough turns for us to do that that we will be unblinded. Advancing. That effect will wear it off. Is he still plagued? He is. One more turn. Okay. One more turn. The Emperor lights up, huh? And then we can heal. So we're gonna keep, we're gonna keep these two near each other. Unleash me! Wow, 
took a lot of damage too. All right, we got a couple of uh, battlefield medications that we need As to you will. administer. Uh, he is not. My blade is ever ready. Uh, plague. So we're gonna go. Wait. Oh what? Really? What? I thought he was di okay. Tell you what. I tell you what. We're gonna use the skull on him then, so that he doesn't suffer that one more turn of plague. Okay, so he is now purified and fully healed. And now we're going to Battlefield Medicine Zavis here. Warp Charge does 12. Wow. Okay, well, that's overkill. For four willpower. It's only 5% on the Warp Surge scale. Yeah, let's just get him up to full. Yeah, I'll give it, that'll get him an action point. I'll tell you what, we're gonna wait until we encounter the enemy, because if that gives them an action point, uh, let's do that just as we are encountering the enemy, and then we'll, that'll give him a bonus action. Where are they, by the way? They're still super far away. <laughs> to finish this mission because my coffee just ran out. Is that like a sprinkler that he's standing on? It's like a sprinkler line. Why would there be a sprinkler line? My blade is yours. I don't know. I don't pretend to understand the forces of chaos. Perhaps they feel they are watering Grandfather's Garden. Okay, let's get... This is Iolanthus. We're getting close now, so we might... Let's put him oh, here. Way. Okay, that didn't trigger anybody. Wow. Chaplain, you fully healed. And ready for action, Chaplain Decrim. He's still blinded for probably one more turn, I think. Two more turns. Jeez. That was an effective blinding. Okay, now I gotta remember to keep him near... Zabus. Zabus. So let's put Zabus... Yes, sir. Here. Okay, and then... Seeking the tainted. Apothecary goes here. Here they come. Ooh. Gee whiz. Yes. <laughs> oh, it didn't cause damage, though. It did knock him back, though, so he's not going to be able to... What? What was that? I've never seen them... Maybe I have. I don't know. What was that? Cover shot? Oh, a cover shot. That has to be what that was, because it just destroyed all the cover, but it didn't do damage to him. I don't think. Yeah, he's only got two armor, and that's what he's got right now, so... Very weird. Okay, now... Now, you... Battlefield Medicine... On this guy, and we're gonna warp charge it. These wounds will heal. So that he's got four actions. My wrath is restored, brother. <sighs> okay, we've got. He's got a looks like a heavy bolter. This guy, it looks like he's got the. I can't really see him. Hazard spray. Okay, yeah. So he's got the whatever weapon it is that does that. This dude's got twelve armor. Seven armor, excuse me. Wait, why does it say seven of twelve? It says, is he, oh, he's mutated. Ugh. Ugh. 
All right. Now, I have completely forgotten about this. So... We need to decide how best to use that. Now, unfortunately, all of these are, are uh, ranged enemies, so... I probably lost the best use of this ability, stratagem. That passed long ago, I'm sure. My blade is yours. Right, first action, however, we're gonna get... We're gonna snag this. Really? You're in range. You tell him you can't see that guy? You can't see up the, the thing? All right. Okay. All right. Fine. We will move you then. How about to here? Um. Yeah. Onward, brothers. Now. There you go. Oh wait, no, no, it's gonna trigger a thing. Oh. I should have done that last. Have that was stupid. That was the dumbest thing. That was even dumber than all the other dumb things I've done this mission. <laughs> Two. Two rifts. Oh. Three rifts. This is coming with me. Oh. Fudge. Two of my guys are blind still for two more turns, or one more turn at least. Okay, do we run like hell now? Is that what we do? We've got one, two here, so I can't run that way. I've got one. Yeah, no, I'm effed. I'm effed. I'm, this is it. This is where we're. This is where we make our stand. Oh, what an idiot! Oh, I can't believe that. I can't believe that. I can't. Yes, I can. It's me. Of course I can believe it, because it's me, and I do dumb crap like that all the time. I am here to serve! I was so excited to be able to claim that last seed. Standing ready. Oh, unbelievable. Alright, then, like, shoot something or something. There's no point, because... Yeah, he's got so much armor, and there's nothing around that does armor piercing. What if... Okay, here's what we do. Here, <laughs> Here's what we do. We do torpor. Torpor. All visible enemies afflict immobilized. All visible... enemies. So do we wait... until... the rifts open? We run everybody over here. Wait till the rifts open. Immobilize them. And then just like run past. Run past, run through. Maybe that's what we do. <sighs> oh, I'm constantly amazed at my stupidity. I don't know why. I don't know why I would be. I've lived with myself for 45 years. I should know exactly how stupid I am. So if we head everybody down this alley here, that blocks line of sight from these guys and whatever comes through here. Well, no, because there's going to be this. It looks like there's a street here. That's okay. But we'll get them at least to here. Okay. The reason I'm doing this is I can't do enough damage to these guys in one turn to, to kill them before I just end up getting swarmed. So... That's my thought process. With haste. Watch, we're gonna uncover like a random enemy patrol. That's what's gonna happen next. <laughs> uh, okay, let's do an overwatch this direction. To hopefully catch whatever's coming out of that rift. I shall halt their charge. 
And we're going to do that as well with um, Apothecary Decoran. Uh, let's move him to here. Decra. Let's move him to here. Moving now. That'll be closer. Chaplain Decrin will get you yes, sir. over here. You know what I should have done? I should have given. Oh, I did it again, you guys! I should have used uh, Honor the Chapter on him and then used Quicksilver on him because right now this guy's all by himself over here. Unbelievable. This is, uh, this, this could be real bad now. What, whatever's about to happen. <sighs> oh, crap. Oh, God. That's an armor-piercing blast right there. Okay, and he's gonna plague him with whatever that hazard spray is. So now he's taking plague damage. And then this other guy is going to come over and shoot him. God, five armor. Dang. I don't have anybody with five armor. Barely a scratch. I sense the enemy inevitable. The inevitable. Yeah, you stop right there by that plasma battery. Oh! Okay, two more of these guys. And hopefully none of whatever this is survives. <gasps> oh, fudge. Okay, they did a lot of damage to him, though. And now we've got a warp surge. No mutations. Oh, God. So much extra armor. No, not him, too. Okay. What? This right here. We're gonna shoot at this with somebody. Somebody shoot that. The Emperor lights our path. Somebody shoot that now. You can't see that. What is wrong with you? Why can you not see that? You have a clear line of sight. Because I did it again. Because I'm not on. I didn't. I swore I clicked on that. Okay. Jesus. Okay. This will destroy his armor and get a point of damage at least. Maybe two. Oh yeah, it does five damage, so it'll do two points of damage. That'll get him down to five. Boom. This is a Blightlord Terminator, which is why that blast did not knock him back, because Terminator armor is immune to knockback. Look at this fat bastard. Oh my god, he doesn't even have eyes. Look at the grin. This, this is a cool helmet, actually. I wish we could take this and put it on our own guys. Like, take it as a trophy. Okay. Jeez. Iolanthus, buddy, we got to get you out of yes, dodge. Uh, can I use warp or crushing charge to just get you out of here fast? Because that's... Is that... Uh farther in one turn than I could get you? Yeah. That's like twice as far. So this is crushing retreat is what we're calling this. Run! <laughs> okay. That, that was good. That worked. That worked. Okay. Um, uh, he's got two actions left. I could get him to here. So he's behind this heavy cover so that he's protected from this nonsense over here. Then he's going to shoot this and hopefully do a bunch of damage to these guys and blow them backwards. 
Okay. Good. Good, good. Now, before I did that, I should have done this. Oh my god. Okay, one of these days I'm gonna actually learn the best ways to do to do these things. Now, I don't know if all these guys are visible. They're in darkness, but I still see their health bars, so we're about to find out. Oh! Okay. Immobilized. All these guys are immobilized for one turn now. <gasps> Him too? Yeah, it doesn't matter, because look at that cannon on this guy. Jeez. Look at this. Look at this. This goes on a tank. You don't carry this with your, with your little paw. This is... All right. Let's do... Let's do... What is your will? Let's do bad things to these guys. Um... Standing ready. The apothecary. Okay, first, use the Medicaid skull on him. Boop. So, he's no longer plagued, and he is healed. So, good use of that. Now, you're going to come up here, and I want you to do everything you can against this guy. Or do I scourge? I can't see these guys, though. I can't scourge. I can get these two. Mm. Okay, what about this? Alright, if I were to... Shoot... Okay, hang on. Hang on. Do you have You're ammo? Loaded. Are you loaded? Yes, okay. What is your will? So let's do this. Cybolt, definitely. Get now. Yes. Support fire, yes. Yeah. Oh, he's got one hit point left. Unbelievable. And he's out of uh, ammo. Okay, so, but he's got one turn left, right? One action? No. No, he does not. He could run up here and just slap the guy, though. But... I'm gonna shoot him instead. Back. Awesome. Okay, now. You can't say that me setting up that Overwatch on that rift wasn't a lifesaver there, because that Blightlord Terminator didn't get a single shot off. We took him out before he took a single action. So. That was a good defensive play. Now, he's got one action left. I don't think that there's really anything else. Teleport strike? I can't get far enough to get these two. And remember, everybody's immobilized for one turn. So, what I could do is everybody who's left... He's reloaded. I don't need to shield him because nobody can shoot at him. Um, he's out of actions. <laughs> Here we go with this. I could just start blasting away at these guys. Uh... Kill them if I run at them. What if I do that? If I force strike. Oh, 50% chance to cancel. Well, this could be bad. Yep, okay, you blocked it. You punk. Alright, well, we're gonna do it again. Well, didn't get the critical. And now... Uh, yeah, 
Yeah, there's really no reason to do that because everybody's immobilized. But it makes me feel better. Chaplain's gonna take a hit from that plague bearer. He can't move. That's it's gonna uh, what? Heal, armor, resistance bonus. Hit back. Oh, hobbled. <laughs> okay. Oh, that was somebody else that was healing. I was like, I thought that was the plague ridden. They don't do that. Okay, um, pretty good use of immobile of uh, immobile wise torpor. That's what it's called because all those guys would have come at me and they can't now. And I just have to. This is the end. This is it. As soon as this turns over, I extract. So, so good. Yes. Good, good. All right, so we're gonna. Don't block it. Good. Okay. I am the Empress Fury. Now you're gonna come over here, and you're gonna get out your frustrations on this guy, and you're gonna force strikes. So you can kill him. Oh, my cancel. Well, he does this. Slap. Him. He didn't. Interesting. Iolanthus, you're gonna shoot him to death. I saw. Okay. For the golden throne. Now, oh, he's out of willpower. I was gonna grant him some action so I can get him out of the out of the open, but I think he'll be all right. Uh, let's see. I don't really want to get anywhere over here. I just want my dudes to kind of hunker down. I took care of two of those rifts. And now they're just gonna. Now they're just gonna wait. With me, my brother. Okay, let's let's scourge just for the heck of it. It's not gonna. Yes, it will. It'll hit these guys. Face the Emperor's works. judgment! I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if that did anything at all. Uh, let's shield him up. The Emperor I don't know. protect coming around the corner and then if we overwatch down this alley hopefully that'll keep somebody from coming down on my way coming this way at us and by that same activated. we're gonna put Zabus here with haste and he's also going to overwatch down this alley with me, my brothers. Boom, 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 boom. Nice. Oh, is he gonna is he gonna get a shot off on them? Yeah. Plagued both of them in the last round. Awesome. Your knight's heal abilities to reduce to zero. Okay. 
<laughs> well, we're teleporting out anyway, so... Not worried about that. Oh, sweet! That went pretty well, except for the... 14 mistakes I made. Drop a note in the comments. List every mistake you think I made. Maybe I'll when I when I edit this and I and I <laughs> put this up. Maybe I'll make my own comment and list all the the stupid things I did. That would be fun, actually. Whoa! Look at that. Okay, five Morbus seeds, eleven Dolorous seeds. We got five requisition for completing the main objective plus the glorious deed. Ten servitors. That puts us up to I believe seventeen. So, when we get three more, then we'll be able to do the uh, top tier plasma generator upgrade. Okay, let's see what rewards we have available to us. A rank 7 purifier. Purifier. Not purgator, purifier. This is a new... This is a new class. Rank 7. Whoa! Uh... Yes? How many requisitions is that going to take? Three. Only three. Okay, because it's based on the tier level. That's right. Yeah, let's let's take... Let's welcome Kemuel Basque. Awesome. Okay, uh... Tier one, Stormbolt or no? Uh, tier three... How, tier three Halberd does... Bonus damage to demons can be upgraded a lot. Wow, look at that. Four bonus damage against demonic targets. Plus 20% crit chance against demonic targets. That's cool. Uh, Champion's Plate Power Armor grants eight bonus health. Grants a passive war gear slot once you upgrade it total of two armor. Oh no, I'm sorry, one armor. One bonus armor. Okay, got it. And, oh wow, and the health the health can be upgraded an additional four for a total of twelve bonus health just for wearing this plate armor. <gasps> oh yes, please. We will take that. And what is this skull? Seeker skull. Uh, yeah, it could be useful. I don't know. I don't use things like that. I, I, I fly in, seat in my pants, fight whatever shows up. Okay, so we will take, yes, we will take the new rank 7 purifier. This is the first time we've ever had that class available to us. On the ship. And I've got, oops, what did we get? Got another Chivo. Two promotions. Iolanthus, rank 6. Congratulations, sir. You have earned that for sure. Let's get him some bonus health, maybe. Stun, plus one stun on the, the crushing charge. We really gotta make better use of the crushing charge. I just don't feel like I've... Either I've missed the opportunities, I've completely uh, been blind to them as opportunities, or I just don't... I, I just, I'm just not finding the, the best ways to use it. Okay, so up here we've got ranged weapon bonuses. Over here is hammer hand. I don't use hammer hand that much ever, really. I think I used it a bit the last mission. Aegis shield upgrades, which leads to provoke or rend the unclean. Hmm. See, let's forego this for now. Uh, we could get him a plus 10% critical chance for ranged attacks. We could get him. I kind of want to go this way. So let's give him a hammer hand. Wow. That'll be a good extra option available for melee. Light wound for 10 days. And now Zabus, awesome. Rank 4 up to 5. 
And we've got supporting fire down here. We've got teleport strike up here. So we've been using both of those a lot. These two are damage bonuses. So we could do this auto gains plus two per shot or plus one. So let's take the plus two first, naturally. Uh, this is, we can warp charge teleport strike to add two damage to each attack. And this is just a plus one damage regardless. Unwarp charged. So I want to do that. Because warp charging takes willpower and yada yada. Using teleport strike already takes willpower. I mean, if I can get like up to three or four hits in, that's. Yeah, we'll do that. 15 days. Wow. Yeah, look at him. Look at him. They all came back scratched up. But they did well. I'm proud of the proud of the crew there. All right, so Bloom Corruption here on Legata Prime is down to 2. And what do we have here? All these wounds. Wow. That was my timeline was half that size before this mission started. <laughs> All right, 17 servitors. Do we want to get a project going? Is there something we can do while we tool around? We could use 10 of them to get the Libris Tier 2 upgrade going. That'll increase Grimoire effectiveness by plus 40%. That could be useful. Gun batteries and void shield. Okay, can't do the top tier gun batteries yet. Uh, barracks. I've got three berths available, so I don't feel like I need that yet. Yeah, really, the Libris is the only thing. This, I, this is what we want. But it would take us 15 days to earn enough servitors, to build enough servitors to be able to do that. So that's time spent not doing anything. I could do this for 10 days. We will generate two more servitors on top of it while that's happening and then surely in that time there will be a mission available where we can get some so we're gonna go with the Libris the faster we can get Vakir getting through research the faster we can get we can uncover the location of the other Reapers because look Warp Storm, we've got two Death Cruisers out here. This area up here looks like bad news. Yeah, we can't get to this mission in time. That's just going to... Oh no, I didn't mean... Item number 16 on today's Dan effed up list. That's fine, we can, we can stop travel. Pause. Ooh, look at that. Ooh, he's coming. All right, yeah, we're gonna go. We're gonna go that way. Research complete. Bloom seed purification. Mortis. Okay, so mortis seeds. I've been studying how the bloom mortis propagates so quickly despite its lethality. The answer is fear. A metaphysical disease has many vectors, and the mortis strain is transmitted through the terror that spreads from victim to victim. Wow, it's like a mental thing. Yet while the plague exploits fear, we shall bestow resolve, using the mortis seed's ash to fortify your knight's spirits. After all, you know no fear. Yep, okay, let's get another project going. So, great, we've got mortis seeds now cost one less to upgrade. Across the seeds, uh, purity seals cost one less, and tenterous. So the last one is dolorous, the red one. We just picked up a bunch of those, so we've got the seed available. Ten days to do that research. Uh, we could start also working on some of these. These are going to reveal. the Reaper associated with that particular seed, but I want to get upgrades going first. Um, let's see here. Yeah, 
Yep. Okay. So now we now we tool around for a while. Ooh, I've got a, got a prognostic car now. Um, so we can do this area here. This area is almost completely attuned. As it, like up to here. Hmm. What's the time like look like now? Libris upgrade will be done in three days. Grandmaster report in two. Ooh. Hopefully he'll be happy that we uh, took out one of the Reapers. Uh, okay, all right. I think we're we're, we're looking all right. Let's um. I think I'm gonna wait to see where the next bloom spawn pop up before I decide what, where I'm going to tune this prognostic car. Yeah. Commander, I have encountered some obstacles with my current research. I have located a grimoire in a nearby inquisitorial facility that will be of some use. It would, however, require a short detour to secure it. Alternative. A servitor could be reconfigured to more thoroughly scan the archives for relevant data. The Inquisitor is only human. There is much she could have missed. I miss nothing, <laughs> Tech Priest. <laughs> Commander, it would only be a short journey to recover this tome. Uh, okay. Travel to the facility, undertake the quest to recover the grimoire, abandon this line of research, current research project will be cancelled. Absolutely not. We've only got three days before we're complete. Uh, reconfigure servitors to scan the archive. We'll lose three servitors. Mm. Gosh. I'm inclined to undertake the, the quest. The only thing is I don't know where the facility is. And it could be in the middle of that warp storm. I don't want that. But let's do it. Excellent. I will have the astropaths alert them to our arrival at once. Research suspended for 30 days. <laughs> Can I Ugh. What the f Okay, so here it is. If I get here and get the thing, will will I be alright? Will that solve the problem? Oh, Grandmaster Report. <laughs> Commander, though I am concerned with how rapidly I see this bloom is spreading, your demands of Titan's armory have been growing dramatically. The commander of a Grey Knight strike force must exercise self-discipline in the sacrament of battle. Have you been truly adhering to the virtues demanded of your station? Dude. What? All right. Return unneeded equipment to Titan. You will lose two unequipped mastercrafted items. Unequipped mastercrafted items. Undertake a ritual of penance. Three knights will be unavailable for some time. Sidestep the Grandmaster's request. I don't want to lose two unequipped mastercrafted items. Because it's probably going to take like my top tier stuff. If it takes my tier one stuff, I'm fine with that because I've got other things. But All right, Grandmaster. I, I apologize for my greed. I will undertake the ritual of penance. You impress me. Commander. Oh. Even a veteran captain would be reluctant to sacrifice his best warriors in the midst of an active campaign. I eagerly await the results. Of course. Now that Dang. he finally acknowledges the threat, he recants his support. Thoroughly sensible. Mm -hmm. Ascent. Results require resources. Outcomes are not achieved through aspiration alone. 
The plight we contend with here is matched by unspeakable horrors our brothers face elsewhere across the galaxy. The gifts the Emperor has given us are mighty, so we consider it a virtue to achieve heroic deeds with the barest of arms. Do not forget this, Commander. Chaos does not fight with one hand tied behind its back. Yes, thank you, Vakir. <sighs> Alright, so we've got max level uh, night requisition. That's good. So do we want to go for these other things? We can get top tier. Okay, well, ranged, we're, we're behind. So let's go boop. And we get top tier there. Do we wait? We've only got two requisition now. Nope. Nope. This is the reason I save requisition sometimes. is because of this. Because it, this guarantees the... Or this gives you the best chance at getting the best stuff. So this now gives me rank 5 for melee. I use melee a lot. Here we go. So yeah. So now we've got... Oopsie doodle. Now we've got a high chance of getting tier 3 items and tier 2 items. We'll never get tier, tier 1 melee weapons again, so that's good. Okay, am I satisfied with a bit? It's, I don't know, man. Oh, what's happening? Oh, we got a cutscene coming. That old Chaos Demon Hunter's black screen. What is happening? Look at Ektar, her cat walking. Your alert has disrupted my essential meditations. We have important tidings. I can already sense Nurgle's corruption. There is something foul at work. Uh-oh. There. What? Curious. What? We have only just had word from Grandmaster Kai. The prognosticars on Titan have augured the advent of a dire omen in that very system. They spoke of a black edifice, a vortex of foul malevolence. Preliminary estimation, not to have crown. The Eldari Avatar warned me of this. Five charred gates in a putrid orchard. Then the Morbus will come. The Xenos are not to be trusted. Uh oh. The enemy of my enemy, Ektar. I detected no malefic intentions. We should not forget that the Plague God despoiled their home. Commander, let us be clear. If we do not investigate this threat, the consequences will be dire. Hmm. I don't like the look of whatever that is. The bloom has spread to a critical stage of corruption. If we do not stop it now, it will advance the Morbus. Okay. Okay, select this system. But we're gonna do this. We gotta do this first. I can't do this? Oh my god, it's gonna force me to go there? If we fail five flowering missions, the Morbus will come, and this sector will be doomed. Oh yeah, well look at that, because it's gonna take us almost... Oh. <laughs> All right. Oh god, and, and bloom spawn? Come on now. Ugh, all the way over here. Oh my god, this planet's going to go to tier 4. Oh man. And this one and what? 1 2 Is this the third one, I guess? Okay, let's go. Okay, ship project complete. Libris Malleus 2. Commander of the Libris Malleus has undergone a further refit. The scriptorium array now has an appropriate auger matrix, so it can scan through pages and data tapestries quickly. Of course, the auger's memory files need to be purged on a regular basis. I will try to remind the Inquisitor, but she's getting increasingly protective of her claimed domain. Awesome. Plus 40% research speed. Let's see what else we can build, if anything. We've only got the nine servitors. I think maybe we just wait, because... We really need this plasma reactor. 
Uh, void shields? Uh, we can get some void shields going. Maybe that's where we go. Further protect the ship. Yep. Void shields. There are balloon spawn missions that grant 15 to 20 servitors, which is enough. I don't want to waste time with Dominus just sitting, not doing anything. So, as long as I've got the servitors, I want her working on some kind of retrofit of the ship. So, Iolanthus, let's see our timeline. Iolanthus will be ready in a day. Uh, four days... Okay. Harn is still on assignment. He's going to come back a paladin, though. And then these three are on assignment for two months? I just got Basque. Ugh. Whatever. Whatever, Grandmaster Kai. Oh, no. Look at this. Look at this. Uh, uh, get out of there. Oh, close. Man, look at this. They are really... Oh, good. Void shield's done already. Deeper analysis of the Void Shields revealed the existence of several weak spots where protection was almost non-existent. Unacceptable. The layers of shielding were miscalibrated and so out of phase with one another. After completing the 12 rites of Ascendant Harmonization, I am pleased to report that the Edict has complete Void Shield coverage. Wonderful. Plus one Hall Integrity, we're now up to five. Uh, with two little servitors, we cannot do any other projects. So, Dominus, take a vacation. Oh god, this is about to happen. I wonder if Harn will be back by then. I don't think so. I don't think it's going to take me three days to make this little jump right here. Nope, just one day. Okey. A flowering mission. This is the first one we have attempted. Don't know what to expect, but that was a very unpleasant looking gate that we have to investigate with the spiky inward facing inner ring. We will take care of that next time. Thanks for joining me for this one. I would appreciate it if you hit the like button. Subscribe if you enjoy if you are enjoying this. Are you playing Chaos Gate Demon Hunters? Don't forget to uh, list in the comments all the things I screwed up on that mission. That would be fun to see. Uh, to see if there's even things that you all noticed that I missed. Uh, anyway, until next time, stay vigilant. Enjoy the rest of your day. Thanks for watching. Oh, yeah.